kind of thinking, damn, I got fat. Plus, my hair is shorter and pulled back, and uh, it's a very fucked up angle. Ooh, I got shirts, bitch. Um, not that anyone watches this or knows anything about me or whatever, but just wanted to say about the whole mask thing and like social distancing because I was in IGA the other day at the store. We live up in Copperopolis. Where the fuck's that? Exactly. It's a little country town. So you think people are less stupid, and a good amount of them are, but mainly the old bitchy people have nothing else to do except bitch. So they're out there bitching. I was in IGA, and this one chick, old lady, old short gray hair, little fucking cunny looking bitch, um, she went this, like literally this close to my face, so I'll put on your mask. I'm like, so you waving your fucking hands in my face isn't gonna make me wanna pull up my mask, I mean, I have, I have a fucking, my wife bought these, like, Hanes ones, so they're not as gay, they're just, like, black, cotton, you know, Hanes underwear, you know, like, that kind of material, and, uh, I had it on my chin, because it's fucking annoying, and I don't see how it helps, you know, she's like, put on your mask, I'm like, suck my dick, you know, and, like, the, one of the girls that works there was like, yeah, she has no reason to, like, damn near assault you, you know, just to say, put on your mask, like they're not required, it's not a law, like, some of the bigger corporations, like, Costco, or in, like, box, big box stores, they have, they say you have to have them, because they're a corporation, so it's store policy, it's not just law, so, okay, give them that, whatever, I'll still wear the fucking thing when I go to Walmart, I mean, it's not that big of a deal, it's just the fact that people, it's like, oh, we got to the store, oh, fuck, where's our mask, we can't go in the store, we have to cover our face with our shirt until we go buy a fucking mask, you know, or fucking, it's just, it's just so interesting, like, I guess it's a new way of marketing, it's a new thing to sell, it's definitely, definitely interesting, I get it, like, I'm on Vistaprint, where I got this shirt, and I get my business cards, and all that shit, they have masks, and yeah, that's kind of a good way of advertising, because on your face, everyone looks at your face, but I don't know if I want to sell out that much yet, but I mean, if I have to wear one, I might as well fucking support my company, but whatever. Oh, was I getting it? Oh, yeah, but I've gotten in arguments. Like, I defended the guys at Ace Hardware on Nextdoor, and I got bitched at for that by people like, oh, I'm not going to do business with you because you don't wear a mask, and da 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 Like, okay. Please tell me, like, why I've t- I have OSHA 10 certification and all this shit, and, and like, silica training, and, like, the ICRA infectious disease control training, and all this shit through the carpenters. Like, why would they tell us that you have to have a certain mask for wood chips and, and sawdust? A certain mask for painting, a certain mask for gas fumes and toxic chemicals, a certain mask for actual health protection. Like, there's different kinds of masks for different things. So why are you going to tell people they can knit something and put that over their face or get, like, underwear material or paper or gas mask or, like, these fucking face shields? Have you seen people wear these fucking face shields? It's like, holy shit. The only time I'm going to wear a face shield is if I'm using a grinder. Like, come on now, motherfuckers. Like, how stupid are you? Like, what is that doing? You know, there's lots of theories how it's just a way to control people and see who's easily manipulated. The ones wearing the mask, like in the Bible, when they put the lamb's blood over the doors because they're scared of their firstborn sons are going to die. But it's like a target, you know? I swear. Uh, it's just smoke and mirrors, literally. Um, yeah, I don't understand. If you have to have certain masks, how is that stopping anything? Wearing a mask all day is not good for you. Like, they say you're only supposed to wear it a certain amount of times. Like, when you're chipping concrete and you wear the silica respirators, you're only supposed to wear that for a, cer- a couple hours, and then you stop because it's not good for you to breathe in your own recycled air. You're not getting enough oxygen. Just like how there's studies how breathing out of your mouth is unhealthy because you're not getting the proper oxygen. Imagine, like, with a mask. Like, come on. Like, I don't understand why people are this stupid. I don't see how it's going to help anything. I thought you're all- in the beginning you're only supposed to wear a mask if you're sick. You know, like, but if you're not sick, you're just like, oh, don't spread your germs. Or, like, you see the fucking lanes nowadays at stores. It's like, oh, we go this way or one way or six feet apart. But, like, they're so close to get, I don't know if you see, you've probably seen the memes if you're watching this because it's everywhere now. You know, like, six feet apart, what is that doing? Or, like, all the windshields that they have now, the plastic things they have at grocery stores and gas stations. Like, what is that doing? Can they not go over the fucking windshield or around, like... You know, and plus two, if you're in a store with circulated air and it's airborne and you're wearing gloves and a mask, what if you, when you take off your mask and touch the mask or you take, take off your gloves and you touch your clothes, if it's airborne, isn't it going to be on your clothes? Like, 
you know what, I don't understand the logic there. It just, there's no fucking, there's no whatever. If you're sick, yeah, wear a mask, you know. But the common cold and the flu kills more fucking people. Like, there's a lot of shit that kills more people and no one gives a fuck. Because it's not marketable. I feel this generation of social media and all this this stuff, like the radio and the TV and everything telling you to stay home and be safe and wear a mask and only celebrities apparently get sick. Like, have you fucking noticed that? Or protests are cool, you know, freedom of speech because all the stupid Black Lives Matter shit, which don't get me started on that shit. They're fucking racist and fucking stupid. You know, but I was like, how is that okay? You know, all the riots and like, like my hometown and stuff like that and just everywhere. It's just like fucking surreal. The kind of world is coming to you. If every year, I swear, it gets worse and worse and there's a new fucking global whatever, like what's going to happen next year, I wonder? What's 2025 going to be like? 